Hello future investors and welcome back to another weekly episode. Now in today's video, I'm gonna be talking to you about whether you should buy a quarter ounce gold Britannia or a five gram gold Britannia. So which one should you buy and what are the differences between the two? Well, first of all, this 2022 quarter ounce gold Britannia sells for £417.10. and pence. And this five gram gold Britannia sells for £282. What are the differences in gold content between the two? Well, this quarter ounce gold Britannia has a gram content weight of 7.775 grams. Whereas this gold five gram Britannia in the bar form has five grams exactly. The purity of both bars and coins are four nines, that's 999.9. This is a quarter ounce of gold, hence the 7.775, and this is five grams of gold. The value of this quarter ounce, again, is £417, and this bar is £282. So there is a slight difference in value, but there is a slight difference in weight contents. Now, the good thing about gold is when you purchase both of these, or either of these, you do not pay any VAT on your gold, because in the United Kingdom, gold investment Bullion purchases are VAT exempt, unlike silver, which has a 20% VAT premium on top. So which one should you buy and why? Well, personally, I think it comes down to personal preference. Both of these are extremely liquid and would sell very quickly. And they're also equally as easy to purchase, either from private sales or bullion dealers. Do they feel any different in terms of weight and how substantial they look or feel? They feel very similar in weight because this is slightly heavier alone on pure gold content, but with the bullion card that this bar comes in, it kind of makes up for it. So they feel the same weight. The designs are equally as beautiful on both, very detailed, although very different. The benefit to having the coin is if you look to the left here on the coin, it has that padlock. This padlock is a security feature to help identify fraudulent pieces, whereas the gold bar does not have this. This just has a lovely Britannia design, which also would be very hard to create a fraudulent piece, but it would be much harder to do that with the Britannia. So if you're looking for a piece that you th feel will be more safe, more secure, and possibly slightly more easy to sell, I would go with the quarter ounce Britannia. But if you've got a little bit less money and you're not sure if you wanna spend up to 400 pound plus for a quarter ounce, then a bar is equally as good at around 282 pound because you still get five grams of gold in four nines. It's a beautiful piece. It comes in this lovely blister card, which I think is amazing because it protects it very, very nice. And the bars to me always seem to get a little bit more attention than the coins. That's my opinion. I don't think there's a right or wrong answer. If you're in precious metals for the long term, either of these is a good a good purchase. It just depends on how much you're willing to spend. If I was to purchase again, with the knowledge I have now, I would go for the quarter ounce Britannia because it's got more gold content in it. So in the long term, I'm hedging against inflation better and hopefully making a better investment because my purchase is bigger. However, I would like to buy some more five gram bars, possibly even bigger bars, because I just think they're so iconic. You know, the gold bars, you see them in the movies. You never really see the coins unless it's in a bloody pirate film. So there's no right or wrong answer, personal preference, yeah. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, please like the video if you've enjoyed it. And if you've stayed all the way to the end, I'd love it if you left a comment to let me know what you thought. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. And make sure you go and follow us on Instagram as we put out content on there all the time. Thanks for watching as always, guys. And I look forward to seeing you in the next episode. Bye-bye.